This is a kneeling quad stretch. So today we're gonna use a pad. If you don't have um, a foam pad like this, a couple pillows works. We're using a chair. You gotta find something that's the right height for your foot to place your foot on. So that'll make sense in a couple seconds here. Uh, but you can use a, a couch, um, couch cushions, something I'm sure you'll be able to figure this out. You can use actually a wall if you tolerate that. Uh, but we're gonna use a chair today. So Luke's gonna kind of get down into this position. So this is a stretch for the muscle, the big muscle in the front of your leg. So getting down here, we use that pad so you're not beating up your patella too much. And from here, what we're doing, and Luke probably is already feeling a stretch there a little bit, but basically we wanna try to get into a little bit of a pelvic tilt. So he's gonna kind of rotate his pelvis back, which you can kind of see how we did that. You don't wanna get into too much extension here because you might pinch some of the structures in the lower part of the lumbar spine. But basically if you're feeling a stretch in the front of the leg as you turn that pelvis back, then you know you're doing it correctly. Stretch in the front of the leg, not any pain in the knee, not any pain in your back, you're probably doing okay. If this isn't enough of a stretch, what you can do is kind of shift your weight forward. So loop will kind of come forward a little bit, it'll bring that foot forward, come forward, and you'll feel that even just a little bit more in the front of that big muscle in the front of your leg, your quadricep. 